Uh, we have a one view. Morning. Good morning. I'm Sophie. I am an early childhood teacher in New Zealand culture context. So because you know, last night、uh, we were announced to lockdown for three days because I live in South Island of New Zealand, and for Auckland, unfortunately, they are going to lockdown for one week. So I still wanted to do something for children, and so I'm thinking probably this could be a platform for me to go and so keep doing morning circle time. So it's really common in、um, I mean around the whole world、uh, uh, for early childhood teacher to start to like、um, the day by welcoming everyone. And、uh, then keep going with the songs and the books and all the like the kind、uh, of like part of the the teaching and、uh, communication or communicating share information、um, session. So it's not like so compulsory for kids must join us. It's kind of like voluntary. And、uh, I am a, a toddler teacher,、uh, aged from two. Uh, kind of like one and a half to four years old, so I got all this cool, quite lucky. Even locked down at、uh, midnight, but I still have some resources at home. So as I advertised,、uh, I'm going to welcome everyone first, and then we're going to read.、Uh, uh, now we need to stretch, stand up, warm up our body, do some stretch. Especially toddlers, they really like the stretching parts、uh, and do dancing. You know, I think <laughs> even as a parent, you must know like a really popular song,、um, "Baby Shark Do Do." And、uh, also, we、um, after that we can do some dance, one one or two songs, and then you also need to bring children down by introduce the quiet music. And、uh, then we can do some、uh, like quiet music or, or yoga stretch、uh, or read a book. So that's the like a whole plan of the day. And、uh, how about before people jump in, I read a short story. Hmm, I'm thinking. Oh. I think I will keep going, keep going, doing my、um, normal routine things. And、uh, first, still welcome. <laughs> we'll see. So,、um, Molila, Tamali Kima, how are you today? Kite pihia kwe into the Maori. We say kite pihia kwe. How are you today? If you say I feel good, and then you give you some. Yourself a thumb up. Say I am good. Or if you don't feel really happy or feel a little bit tired, you can say I am okay. One up, one down. <laughs> And、uh, if you don't feel really,、uh, really happy or really, really sad today, you probably can ask your friend for a cuddle. And、uh, first, we're going to welcome everybody. So, so we need you wiggle your fingers, wiggle your finger. Tolu fa ti na kui hello to one ti na kolu a hello to two ti na koto hello to all hali my everyone welcome everyone. Yeah, that's our little Maori version welcome song, and there's even more like a welcoming song, and I will introduce them by the following days. And、uh, next one, how about we all eat to stand up and do some stretching and warm up? Here you go. So what you can do? Here we go. Give some. Remember, give yourself a lot, a lot of space, and can you reach up high, and、I、try to touch the sky, and now can you bend it down to tickle your toes, and now can you tip your body, 
to one side. Yes, give a little bit of stretch. Well done. And now take to the other side. And now give yourself a little bit of shake, 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 shake. And can you do three big froggy jump? You ready? One, two, three. Hooray! Well done. And uh, I just felt like a little bit weird um, because normally so we have lots and lots of toddlers around surrounding me and then they all do a lot of different wiggles and the dance. So today's a little bit of quiet. And uh, yeah, it takes some time to get used to that. Second, well, how about we do a really popular sound if you're happy and you know what will you do? You said you felt really good. So, <coughs> get the beautiful singing voice ready. <coughs> We're going to if you're happy song. You ready? To do fa. If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know, what will you do? Mm. How about we wiggle our hips? Wiggle your hips. If you're happy and you know, wiggle your hips. If you're happy and you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and you know, wiggle your hips. <laughs> and what's next? If you're happy and you know, pat your hat gently. If you're happy and you know, pat your hat. If you're happy and you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and you know, pat your hand. If you're happy and you know, what are you going to do next? Should we stamp our feet like a dinosaur? Stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know, stamp your feet. <coughs> if you're happy and you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and you know, stamp your feet. <clears throat> wow! If you're happy and you know, clap your hands this way. Snap! Stamp! Snap! Snap like a crocodile. If you're happy and you know, stamp. Snap like a crocodile. <clears throat> if you're happy and you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and you know, snap like a crocodile. <laughs> and. Uh, if you're happy and yeah, you know, what do you see? What should we do next? Turn around, turn around. If you're happy and yeah, you know, turn around, turn around. Oh, I remember some children always, <laughs> some children tell Sophie, like, Sophie, I'm really good at twirling like this. <laughs> like a ballerina. Yes, you twist your body like a ballerina. If you're happy and yeah, you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and yeah, you know, turn around. Whoa! And uh, if you're happy and yeah, you know, take a seat. Now it's time to sit down. If you're happy and yeah, you know, take a seat. If you're happy and yeah, you know, and you really ought to show. If you're happy and yeah, you know, Take a seat. Ah, give yourself a, a bigger breath. Ah, or you can close your hands and do a buzzy bee. Ready? <laughs> and then one more. Do you feel calm down a little bit? Yes, relax. And the next time, next how about we do some board story? Yeah, we go. I made the board. This is side you can see for magnet toys. And when I turn around, ta -da, that's the felt board. I think today we're going to use the magnet side. And I'd like to have a look. Have a look. 
I know lots of our friends know ABC so well. Do you think you can help Sophie sing the ABC song? I'll show you my show you my resources. There you go. It's a big box of uh, magnetic uh, letters, and uh, this resources has uh, A, E. I O and U there's a one, two, three, four, five, five vowels in red color and the rest consonant use blue blue and uh, make it a uh, the red color makes it so obvious for us to see and the reason why they do this because a e i o u you put that helps you to make the sound more uh, louder and more appropriate so the car car like make this so obvious and uh, get to see your words ready again <clears throat> We're going to see our alphabet song. This song is about uh, connect ABC song and phonics together. So, are you ready? Tolu fa. A is for apple. A, A, apple. B is for ball, b b ball. C is for cat, k k cat. Yeah, you may see C is for C is for cabbage. Yes, and C is also for cat and the car, and then D A B C D. D is for dog, the the dog. E is for elephant, a a elephant. Oh, I found something. Yeah, we go. Oh, I found a little bit. Uh, I think so. We use the wrong letter. We are supposed to find the big upper letter. A B C D B is two B big letter upper letter we we'll call it oh here we go the other one <laughs> sorry A B C D is for elephant a a elephant F is for fish f f fish G is for Gorilla, g g gorilla. H is for hat, her her hat. I is for igloo, e e igloo. J is for what does a J for? J is for juice. You are right. Well done. J is for juice. J J juice. K. What does a K for? K is for. You are right. The kangaroo. The jumpy kangaroo. K is for kangaroo. K K kangaroo. L is for. Line, la la line. M is a for <laughs> monkey. M's for monkey, m m monkey. S for nose, n n nose. What's your nose? Tickle tickle. O's for yeah, 
octopus and O is also for ostrich O is for octopus O, O, octopus Let's see next next peace for piggy yes peace for piggy p p piggy q that one's a tricky q is a for question well q is a for qu qu queen question qu qu question r R, what does R for? R is for, um, yeah, rooster. R is for room, r r rooster. S is for, s s my name, Sophie. <laughs> s is for Sophie, s s Sophie. And also your favorite animal, snake. Yeah, snake. T is for oh, where's a T? Pick up, find you. Yeah, T is for tiger. Wow. U O P Q R S T. So U U is for in a rainy day, what do you hold in your hands to protect you from getting wet? Sorry. Q use for umbrella. Uh, uh, umbrella. V is for violet. Yes, violet or vet. <laughs> you. V W W upper letter W U V W W four yes a window window w w window U V W X X X X six six U V X Y Y is a four yellow. You are right. Now comes to the last letter. I know you know Z is a four zigzag 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 Z or for zoo. Yes, the place you like to visit a lot. You like visiting a lot. So here's our 26 letters song and you can connect to, to phonics and um, if you have a chalk, do you have a chalk at home or your pencil, you can start to like, start the tracing these letters. The reason why I bring this to toddler because our toddler, they are so smart. They always wanted to sing the ABC song. So, yeah, I think this is not too early to introduce to our toddler friends. <laughs> Hope you have enjoyed it. And now we're going to say goodbye letters. Bye-bye letters. We're going to put you away. And Tamalikima, since you have been sitting so beautifully, and how about you help me make a choice of a story? What do you see? Story, story. I have a two, two really cool stories book, two story books. One as the clown, the curly monster. The other, the other one is Macy tidies up. This one's a little bit short. And this one's about your emotions. Which one would you like? Probably this one, the color monster. Yeah, car monsters are always a popular. <laughs> you ready? Okay. There we go. 
Thank you. Oh. Can you all see the book? All see the book? Great. You ready? The Color Monster, written by Anna Linus. This is my friend, Color Monster. Today, he's feeling all mixed up. But he doesn't understand why. Look at you, monster! You are a mess. You have jumbled up all of your emotions and all of your colors too. I know you can separate your feelings and put each one. And its own jar. If you do like, I can help you. This is a happiness. It shines yellow like the sun and it twinkles like the stars. When you are happy, you jump, you clap your hands, you laugh, you dance and play. You want to share the feelings with everyone. This is a sadness. It's a gentle and a blue like a rainy day. When you are sad, you might want to cry or to be alone. Is that to your sad face? Yes. Wow! This is anger. It plays a bright red. When you're angry, you want to stamp your feet and roar and shout. Hmm. It's not the fear. Yeah, that's the way. Yeah, you show your hand, your sadness, and you're angry. Show your anger. And this one. It's a fear. It hides in the black shadow. When you're afraid, you feel tiny and helpless. Fear makes it hard to be brave. I know. Sometimes it just takes time for you to get up, get brave. And this is a calm. It is as a light. As a green leaf floating in the wind, when you are calm, you breathe slowly and deeply. You feel at peace. That's true. All your feelings are in their places now. See, they are easier to understand when you're not all mixed up. But wait, there's a one feeling left out. There's a one feeling left over. What could it be? Yes, as you can see, as the love. You can tell. You can tell the people around you now. You can see. I love you. Get a flying kiss. That's the end of this storybook. Hope you have enjoyed listening to it, and uh, tamaliki ma, tamaliki in Tulu Mali in New Zealand means all the children. Would you like another story? You like Sophie read another story? Uh, I think we have lots of friends like dinosaurs. Do you love dinosaurs? Or you want to Sophie read the book I showed you before? Uh, sorry, the other one. There we go. Oh, Macy. How about we still have a couple of friends I、uh, would like to release more? So how about we read Macy tidies up, and then now we end for the day with dinosaur. Okay, Macy 
Tie this up. Amazing storybook written by Lucy Cousins. Macy is cleaning her house today. Ding dong! Oh, who can that be? It's a Charlie. Come in, Charlie. You are just in time to help Macy tidy up. Charlie can smell something delicious. <laughs> yum yum. What's that in the kitchen, Macy? Lots of yummy cakes. Oh dear, the floors are still wet. You will have to wait until it's dry, Charlie. Well, he's waiting. Charlie tidies up all the toys. And Macy vacuums the sitting room. Then Charlie cleans the window from the inside. And Macy cleans them from the outside. That looks better. At last. The kitchen floor is dry. Now Macy and Charlie can have some cakes. Hooray! Get to the end of this book. Dinosaurs can wait for the dinosaurs. Sure. Dinosaur zoom. That's the first time for me to show this to Tamaliki. That's a really lovely, lovely, lovely book. So lovely. The things like <clears throat> it's a CD book. So Sophie tried to make this sound, but you can probably can help me make that sound. I know you guys are really good at doing that. Let's do it together. Okay. Dinosaur Zoom by Penny Dale. Oh, on the first page. And here comes the surprise! Look, so many dinosaurs. You know what? <laughs> because our Tamaliki, all of all the children and the toddlers, most of them love dinosaurs. So Sophie even pick up the names of the dinosaur. I know a couple of them. Probably you know all of them. I know Triceratops. And I know Stegosaurus and Allosaurus, and this one has a really strong tail. I know that's Ankylosaurus and the Iguanodon can stand up, and uh, Carnotaurus. Hmm, not really common to see Carnotaurus. Carnotaurus. But it's really common to see Styracosaurus and the T Rex. And in this book, I think we're gonna see all of them and what will happen to them. Let's have a look. Red dinosaur driving, driving through the desert, through the desert, dust and the sand. Zoom. Zoom, zoom! Brown dinosaur racing, racing through the tree, through oh, racing through the rain, through the rain, bend round the bend, splash, splash, splash. Blue dinosaurs are climbing, climbing up the mountain, up the mountain, past the rocks and the snow. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Green dinosaur rattling, rattling down the hill, down the hill, 
with a heavy load. Chugger chug, chugger chug, chugger, chugger, chug. Purple dinosaur bumping, bumping through the forest, through the forest along rocky tracks. Vroom, 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 vroom. Orange dinosaur, orange dinosaur jumping, jumping over puddles, over puddles, skidding and screeching. Bounce, 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 bounce. Careful dinosaurs reversing, reversing slowly into the woods, into the woods with a special load. Beep, 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 beep. Busy dinosaurs are hurrying, hurrying to get ready, get to get ready in time. Quick, 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 quick. Excited dinosaurs are hiding, hiding and trying not to move. Getting ready, getting ready for a big. Big, big surprise! A surprise party and party for the little list dinosaur. A party with a pred, a party with the presents, and a great big cake. Happy birthday, little dinosaur! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear little dinosaur! Happy birthday to you! That's the end of this lovely story. And and in the page you can see all the cars. They are really cool. I know lots of kids a lot. I know lots of our friends like tractors and a trailer, and you also like、uh, motorbikes, don't you? And、like、camper van and zoom 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 and the convertible and don't forget to the crane. Somehow they call it a breakdown truck. Lift it up, and、uh, electric sports car and a pickup truck. They are so cool, and that's the end of this lovely book. And I think we've read lots and lots of books already, and I can see some friend is already. They are already jiggling here. They probably feel hungry, right? And、uh, oh, I have a friend who would like to say hello to you. Uh, who could it be? Who could it be? Is this a friend? Hello, 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 hello. Wake up, Tamaliki ma. Can you? How about we count to three and we say "Wake up" to the little turtle? Are you ready? Three, two, one. Wake up! Wake up! <laughs> oh, little turtle, say we'll see you tomorrow. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow, little turtle. So now, how about you help Sophie say goodbye to everyone? Goodbye in Tulu Mali. We say "kakite." In Chinese, we say "goodbye." Kakite. Are you ready? I'll、oh, get get your beautiful singing voice ready. <coughs> Tulu fa. Kakite, kakite, kakite. I know. We will see you. We will see you. We will see you again. 
We'll see you next time, Tamaliki. Kakete, bye bye. Stay at home and be safe. And have a lot of fun. <laughs> see you next time. And uh, uh, I also prepare for the family who can speak uh, uh, English or who's on the way to pick up English. I also prepare uh, prepared a、uh, Chinese book. I would like to read it today. And、uh, as the extra part of this circle time. Oh. Here we go. This actually originally it was a Japanese book, so had has been translated into Chinese. So from now on, I'm going to speak Chinese. Yeah, practice your listening skills. You ready? <clears throat> 准备好了，我的苹果，日本。宫本中夫著。我的苹果，要是猪小妹来了，我就吃一半儿；猪小妹吃另一半儿。我的苹果，要是毛毛虫来了。吃出一个洞，我就吃没洞的地方。哦、oh, ，sorry， 来<笑>，我的苹果，要是大象来了，我就全吃掉，播下种子，等种子发芽，长成一棵大苹果树。结好多好多的苹果，大象就把苹果全吃掉。我的苹果要是小蛇来了，我就使劲儿把苹果榨成汁儿，跟小蛇一起咕嘟咕嘟。我的苹果。要是蚂蚁来了，一只，一只，一只，一只，来了一只又一只，吃也吃不完，那我就先睡个午觉。我的苹果，要是谁也不来，那我就揣到。洞里吧。宫本中夫作者写道：“我喜欢苹果，所以我才吃苹果。苹果喜苹果喜欢我，所以才吃我。”哦，小时候他说他做过这样的梦。爸爸经常去出差，然后给家里寄回来一箱大苹果，那苹果非常好吃。<笑>小朋友们，你们也喜欢吃苹果吗？嗯，在英语谚语里头有一句话说：“啊、uh, ，apple a day keeps the doctor away。” So， 他的意思就是说，你每天吃一个苹果呢，你的身体会非常健康，医生都会远离你。说的好像有一些道理，对吧？苹果的确对我们的身体有好处，希望小朋友吃的时候也要注意安全。啊，一定要坐下来吃饭，坐下来吃饭，这样不容易卡到你的啊嗓子，然后呢，不会影响你的呼吸，好吧？那我们今天就到这里了，我们下次再见，小朋友，下次再见，拜拜，再见啦，再见啦。So we're going to end the streaming, and、uh, I can also read the Korean and the Japanese. And a、uh, little bit of Spanish. So, if you would like to listen to more of、uh, my multi-language, multilingual reading, please remember leave a message and also check the other videos I shared on YouTube videos. And、uh, those videos not about reading books. 
you can see you can like uh, watch one or two videos and then you will see Sophie actually plan the whole thing sometimes about the octopus sometimes as about uh, um, like an eggs uh, sometimes I would like to do something about a festival so combine the cooking and reading books activities all of them together and uh, it's all children friendly language and content and friendly activities so thank you for coming and I will see you next time Kakite see ya Yeah.